Good morning and welcome to the boathouse. Look, we're in the boat. This is what it looks like in the boat. In the boat. Anyways, we got some drinks. We got some uh, food to start with. But we're going to show you what it's like here at the boathouse. Yeah. Starting out with some appetizers. Correct. So we got some, uh, what is this? The tuna? Well, this was the tuna poke, right? What is this? Coconut shrimp? It's, uh, yes. Coconut shrimp. Okay. The, oh, look. Ooh, yeah. With the ap pineapple salsa and an orange chili sauce. Oh, that looks awesome. And we got a bunch of drinks, too. Uh, Jessica got the res duck, res. Duck, duck, res. Duck, res. Not res, res. Duck, 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 res. Grail got the strawberry gin fizz. Me and Sarah, we both got old-fashioned Christmases. Because it's got, you know, it's an old-fashioned. It's got cranberries and, uh... Got some nice rosemary in there. Look at that. It looks like Christmas, mm. but it doesn't smell like, like it. the ghost of Christmas, <laughs> death, whatever it is. <laughs> I don't think so. All right, so I'm gonna have some of this shrimp. Got some of that there. It looks really good. Yeah. Dang, that's good. Yeah. Now some of that sense. old fashioned. We gotta get back into our dinner like, somehow. This is delicious. And now we're going to try some of this tuna, like tuna chip stuff. Listen to this crunch. Not that I wanted them to cook something because I get it because they were so close, but everything mm. they mm. had was like. Yeah, that's really what, fresh. They look like milky white, kind of. It almost looks kind of gross. Mm. It's the shrimp with the. There's just some of the atmosphere in here. But also, our food just came. Look at that. I've got these filet mignon sliders that are gonna be delicious, I'm pretty sure. And we also are sharing this lobster mac and cheese. Look at that lobster in there. There's also andouille sausage. The lobster is actually extra. You gotta ask for that extra. But I mean, look at that. That looks real. Oh, this is gonna be so good. And our friends here, they've got a couple of things. Corel got the mahi tacos that he's about to attempt. And success. Look at that. Nice job, Corel. You're getting so Great good at that. Form. And Sarah, she got the, the Yacht Club Club. Yeah, I didn't stutter. It's a Yacht Club Club. That, that looks like a good sandwich right there. Wow. That is so picturesque. I bet it's gonna be tasty. Oh man, look how juicy that looks. so good. It's like a piece of actual steak. I don't know. It's like an actual filet mignon. It's not like they took filet mignon and ground it up into a burger. It's an actual filet mignon. There we go. Did the old switcheroo with Jessica. So now I've got the shrimp mac and cheese with lobster. Ooh, look at that steam. Did you get that? It's pretty good. I don't know. Do you think the lobster really adds to it? It probably still thing? be good. Yeah. Ooh, the lobster adds $10? Mike could skip the lobster. I mean, it's good, but I don't think it really adds to it. It's really good with just the shrimp and andouille sausage. Unless you just love lobster, I guess. It's still good. There's a still a whole lot of that left, but we ate all the good stuff out of it. No more shrimp, no more lobster. See, Corel, he did really good on his mahi tacos. Sarah did okay on her sandwich. And Jessica, she did the other half of our uh, sliders. Always delicious. Man, this place, this is probably one of our favorite restaurants just because the food is always really good. The atmosphere is really cool in here. And it's just, uh, it's just cool. You know what? I think we're going to go outside and take a look at some of the... Uh, some of the boats that are outside, that'd be cool. 
All right, well, there's what we just ate in the boat. But now, let's go take a look at some other boats outside. Oh, such a nice area out here. What, the dockside bar? Ooh, look. Yeah, that's going up. Oh, look at the birds. Yeah, things. Oh, there's a boat over there. Oh, look at those shark fins. That's really cool. I guess this is a Cadillac or a Cadillac sea lark. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And what's neat about most of these, uh, they have these little plaques here to tell you a little bit about them. Popular science declared that this $11,000 Cadillac sea lark was the most expensive outboard fiberglass runabout ever built. There it is right there. Huh, is it this one? And that one? And this one? The Miss Bell Isle. And there's a bird. Huh. Oh, look out there. We've got an Amphicar car out there. That's fun. You can take those little cars out onto the road. Not onto the road, onto the lake. Gosh. Words. The heck? Oh, look, there's just. <gasps> Oh, did you see that? What the heck? What the heck? Oh, look, there's Jessica playing with the animals. She loves animals. She's such an animal lover. These birds making a heck of a racket. Yep. Anyways, these are the ones that I think are really cool. These wood boats. I think they're called Chris Craft. I think that's what that says right there, Chris Craft. But these are the ones that I think they're really cool. Ooh, look at that bird. It's got a bird in there. Huh. Well, look at this little, that's called a gadget. Look at that little thing. That is tiny. What in the world? That is a super small vessel. Oh, look at this one here. This is made in like the 50s. They call these the nifty 50s. And they made these just like the cars with like headlights and chrome trim, two-tone paint job, and matching engine. This was a golden era for sure. There's another one of those wooden boats. Those are really cool. I do like those. The D White. That's the D White. Well, that was the boathouse. How about that? It's a really good place. We always enjoy it. Excellent food, excellent staff, excellent scenery. It's just a good time. But, anyways, thanks for coming along. Hope that you had a good time. We definitely did. As far as we're concerned, yeah. That's pretty cool.